morning. I thought I'd start off the week by doing a very gorgeous haul. Yes, you guessed it. I got the new Gorgeous Girl stamps and I'm so excited. I've actually had this for about a week now um, or a week and a half. And uh, I just hadn't had a chance to do a haul video because my desk was a crazy mess uh, with all the TNs that I had been creating. So um, now that that's out of my system, I can do my haul videos. <laughs> so I did haul these uh, from several different places. I got super excited when I found out that uh, Gorgeous Girls had a new set of stamps. And you guys know I love my Gorgeous Girls. I haven't played with it in a while. Um, just recently, I started playing again, but I've loved Gorgeous Girls for years now. And so, of course, I had to get, absolutely get, um, the new ones um, that are summer-themed, just fun, fun uh, stamps. Now, these stamps are the bigger stamps. So, the first place that I had... Well, this is the second place that I got it at. But I'll start off with um, Barb's Craft Supplies. And there is her link. She is on Etsy. And look how cute. She even gave me a little uh, gift with my purchase. And I did uh, purchase the Summer Days and the Spring at Last. And I'll show you guys that in a minute. Now, I did pay, you know, a little bit more, $8.50. I know uh, Blitzy is selling these now, you guys. And I think they're a little bit less, like $7, like, you know, less than $8. So, um, but I had to have, have these. And so before Blitzy got them, I went on Etsy and found them. So these are the two. This is called Summer, oh sorry, Spring at Last. Let me just share with you. That is what is called there. And that's the item number. And anyway, it comes with 12 pieces and you get the little girl that's lying down and you can put a like a grassy background and there's a stamp of a book uh butterfly i love these new ones this one is actually part of the postal collection and so with each one you you get these um little postal stamps so you get this stamp and then you also get that one right there okay um, and then just the little flowers and butterflies. So really, really cute, fun, fun, fun for, um, you know, spring, but definitely for summer as well. Okay, so that's the first one. And sorry about the glare. I did not take these off the packaging. Um, here is the next one that I got from Barb's, Cre uh, Barb's Craft Supplies. Uh, this one is called Summer Days. And look how cute this was one of the ones that I fell in love with I had to have her again you get the little girl and this time she is I don't know if she's laying I think it's, it's more like she's sitting on a towel oh no she could be laying down on a towel sorry let me let me move things around a little bit here so you can see the whole thing. She is lying on a towel. There is a beach umbrella there. She has her little book uh, or journal, whatever um, she's doing there. She's listening to a seashell. You get an umbrella stamp. Um, you get another one of those airmail um, stamp as well. One of those. And let me see if I can get it. Ah, there it is. There's the stamp and a starfish. So you get a total of six pieces. Isn't that cute? So super cute. I love it. And in case I forgot to show you that, there it is. Okay. Um, the next one here, I absolutely had to have it. Because once I saw her, I just thought Halloween. <laughs> I don't know. Um, because she's a little pirate. So... How cute. And this one is called Piracy. Right there. And this one actually I got from um, another Etsy shop. And that Etsy shop is called 
they are based in Germany actually so it did take like a couple of weeks to get but um, it is called MK Hobby Shop and um, again they are on Etsy so uh, you can check it out and from them I got the piracy all of these stamps here uh, except for let me see one two three four five so one two three four uh, and then one small little stamp I'll show you that later it's one of those collectible ones the small one okay so yeah the piracy comes with again the little little stamp the airmail stuff um, and then seashells and uh, even bubbles really really cute I love it I love this stamp set how adorable she's in a little um, pirate hat so super cute can't wait to play with that this next one oh I absolutely love her too and she is called little fishes and there it is in case you guys are looking for it um, this one comes with eight pieces and you can pretty much see it there you get the little they look like little koi fish to me um, and a crab and look how cute she has her feet dipped in the water so how how pretty is that to stamp and color right super duper cute I just absolutely love 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 gorgeous girls and for those of you who are not familiar with gorgeous girls um, they are a stamp based at based in the UK um, they've been around for a while uh, they are very popular in the UK and now popular here so you you will get some vendors who do sell them here now but when I first found out about them years ago oh boy it was hard to, to get you know you had to go to like uh, a vendor that's based in the UK so um, they're a little bit easier to attain now so anyway they are like as popular as probably like Hello Kitty Okay, maybe not as popular. I don't know. They're newer. But, um, you know, our Hello Kitty here in the U.S. is that, you know, is their Santoro gorgeous girls over there. They make stamps. They make um, Centauri graphics, makes, um, what do you call it, stamps, um, all kinds of, I mean, bedding. Um, they're just the cutest things for little girls. Um, you know, so bags, wallets, uh, you can check in one of their sites if you just look up Gorgeous Girls um, and do a search. And anyway, um, my understanding is the artist uh, creates oil paintings and then um, that's how, you know, she makes these images. She creates oil paintings and then they become stamps. So really, really just adorable little girls. Okay, so there's that one. This one is called Fly Away With Me. Just adorable. I love it. So she has a balloon and you can, you know, attach it to her hand there. So she looks like she's flying away. And then this one, this actually has been around for a while, but it is now part of their, um, I've seen this before, I know it. So this is called um, a wash, I think. Yes, a washed. So it used to come just as a, a single stamp, I think. I'm not sure. Or with a shell, but now it's part of the postal collection. Um, because it's sea themed as well okay but so super cute and that is that um, now this one here I this one and also the case which is this huge case that I got um, it's beautiful I love it this one is from the cat's meow shop 
shop.com the cat's meow shop.com I will put it on my screen here um, when I do my editing but anyway um, it is a binder basically with a handle and it's made out of I don't know it's like vinyl I guess similar to vinyl um, and it's storage for your um, collectible stamps so which are those little mini stamps I just started collecting them um, <laughs> and the reason is first of all um, I got back into Gorgeous Girl stamps because I saw a couple of ladies do hauls of the new Gorgeous Girls and um, one of the girls is uh, Carolina's Creations, I think. I will leave her link in the description box. Hi, Carolina. <laughs> um, you got me thinking about my gorgeous girls again. So um, she did a haul video on the new stamps and then as well as, uh, is it Ella? Wait, Happily Ella After, I think. And they're the ones that actually referred me to, you know, through their videos. When I watched their videos, they said they got their stamps from the Cat's Meow Shop dot com and I absolutely love the shop um, they have gorgeous girls stuff and then later on when I was doing my search I also found some gorgeous girls on Blitzy I used to get my gorgeous girls from another shop um, that had closed so um, yeah so I kind of stopped buying gorgeous girls for a while but I I love them so anyway this is a great binder from the cat's meow and so it is it has a zipper and it's huge I should have backed backed up a little bit and it comes with uh, I think five one two three four five of these pages that have pockets in them and I hope I'm in frame here they have pockets in them so that um, you can put your gorgeous girl collectible stamps and it comes with one freebie if you buy this um, uh, binder and it comes with the first very first stamp which is Ruby so if you guys love Ruby here she is and again these are little itty bitty stamps um, she is considered a number one stamp and you put it in this little pocket so what you do is you pop them out of their uh, packaging and then that way you can store it. Oops, sorry. Let me see if I can do this without making so much noise. And you pop it out like that. Uh, they are on the acetate itself, so you just stick it in here, and that's how you store them. And it comes with also a collectible card that uh, you can, you know, store separately, or you can just, a lot of people are just kind of putting them in the back here like that. So I will probably um, put it in a wallet or something so I can um, easily get to them. So it's nice to have um, just these little cards because, you know, sometimes when you're um, stamping and then wanting to color them, um, you kind of want to just see, you know, how they've colored it here. I mean, that is if you want to color it the same color, but um, it's just, you know. A nice reference so yeah so what's nice about this binder is that it does number them and it tells you a lot of the times you know we have the stamp and it's like uh, what is she called <laughs> and they have their names on you know they actually have little labels on the bottom of the container here and it's just so cute it's just a cute way to store them and see the first one you get is uh, Ruby so you get this beautiful picture of Ruby as well. And then, um, so they they come with four pockets per page. Um, I believe you can store as many as 40 in here. I don't know, maybe even more um, if they create some more. But I think right now um, the collectibles are a total of 40, 40 stamps. So this is really cute. Now the only thing is I do have to make... Um, and I've heard other people say that it's kind of difficult to um, flip the pages. So you do have to cut your holes a little bit bigger so that it slides a little more easily on this ring. Um, isn't she cute? And I'm glad they put her up because I absolutely love Ladybird. She is one of my faves. I have a lot of faves, but she is 
one of my very, very, very um, favorite. And then, so this one is pockets uh, 9 through 12. Okay. And she is so darling. I love it. And then this one has her in the back. And I'm sorry that this is really big and I should have moved my camera up higher. Sorry, wasn't quite prepared there. And then this one has that. But you guys can check out the other um, ladies' channels um, that I can put the link down below so you have a better uh, look at this binder. Because um, I did see a few ladies haul this. And of course I had to get one myself. If you are a gorgeous girl lover, you are <laughs> going to want one of these. And it's just a little cute storage. And it has the pictures of the gorgeous girl all around. All around, even in the back. See? So, so stinking cute. I love it. And this will run you anywhere from about, uh, I don't know, 26 to $30, somewhere there. That is probably the best deal you're going to get, unless you like get it from eBay or something. I don't know. So, yeah. And then um, I also, from the catsmeowshop.com, I also got this uh, sticker sheet. It comes with 30 pieces so there's 15 in each side there or each sheet and oh my god they're just so cute but you only get f uh, 15 different stamps so you got the newer stamps there as you can see and I'm just showing you I absolutely love this one here um, she is called something sweets. I forgot, but oh my God, she is so darling. And look at the, the candy cane, the sugary treats on the bottom. Oh my gosh. I can't wait until she becomes a stamp. Cause I have not seen her yet as a stamp. Um, or maybe, no, she is a stamp, but it's one of the little tiny ones. Um, but yeah, I can't wait to get her as a bigger stamp. So I hope they do make her bigger. But see, they're super cute, and it's the same on the back. So, yeah, I got a couple of these sticker sheets, and they're so cute because they look like little stamps. So if you're going to, you know, send uh, a little gorgeous uh, package, you definitely have to put a little gorgeous girl stamp on there, right? <laughs> so really cute. I also got these decoupage packs, and this is the A4. So this is not um, an ultimate die cut pack. Those are more expensive because they come with um, the die cuts, the decoupage um, pieces, and uh, tags, and usually some paper. This one is, um, you know, less. So for this one, you get four papers and then sheets of the die cut uh, decoupage. So um, let me just go ahead and open one for you so that you can see. Because I know some of you um, did, uh, or one of you asked, you know, why do they call it decoupage um, on one of my comments. Um, yeah, so I'm not really sure why, but I guess, I don't know. You can, maybe there's, maybe they're meant to be like, you know, for you to decoupage them. I don't know. But, um... This is how they come, and you can layer them. So as you can see here, see how she doesn't really have legs there? Um, you can layer her on top of this one and this one. It, it actually gives you numbers, so you know how to layer them. But isn't she cute? I think this one is, I'm not sure if she's part of the Tweed collection. She might be, yeah. So um, you get two sheets of that. Of her and then you also get this one here she's so cute as well and this one is just adorable look at her she looks like a little toddler <laughs> a gorgeous girl toddler how adorable right and um, yeah they're really thin so you just pop them out pop out the die cuts really cute so you get two of that 
the same one also that you can layer. And I love how they come in these um, frames, ornate frames. It's just really pretty. Gorgeous Girl is just so pretty. Um, the papers are very thin, just to let you guys know. And this one was crinkled. Um, so um, it's okay. I can live with it. I'm not about to, like, <laughs> um, you know, ship it back. Um, it's okay. You know, it's not like these are my favorite colored papers anyway. But as you can see, it's tweed. It has that um, design on it. Okay, so yeah, that's all you get. And um, these are like those single, you know, single, I, I don't know, A4 decoupage is what it's called. Um, and don't forget that the packaging also, you can cut it up. And they have images in there, which I just can't show you right now. But um, I don't. I haven't really cut up my packages yet, so <laughs> um, it's hard to because I have them stored. Like I said, I have a few of these decoupage pieces, and I am loving them. So, yeah, these are great. Um, so, where did I get this one? I think I got this one from, if I'm not mistaken, I think I got this particular one from Blitzy. So here's the other one. I'm not going to take it out. But um, there's the decoupage pieces. Those are the little girls that you get. Let me just kind of zoom in on them. So, oh, that's not focusing, is it? Okay, but anyway. And um, this one's called Pink Poppy. Sorry, the other one, the one I showed you, is called Night Light. Okay. So those are the decoupage um, packs. And then, oh, do I have time for this? I'm sure you guys have seen all this, so I'm just going to go through them. Um, I don't have all of them. Um, I only have some. So here you have New Heights. That's the girl that's standing on the books. She's number two. I have the Pretend Friend. Okay, I have this one here. She is with the teddy bear and she is called Forget Me Not. And there's Lady Bird. Lady Bird, number five. Um, this one is I Found My Family in a Book. Mind frame, sorry. Really cute. Um, this one here is White Rabbit. Love her. She's one of my favorites too. And this one here is called I Gave You My Heart. Okay. And then this one is I Love You Little Rabbit. Really cute. Fine frame here. There's this one here. And who, what is she called? Oh, Perfect Love. That's what she's called. I keep trying to figure out this, this little one here. I don't have a big one of that. So she's kind of new to me. Love her. I have the big stamp on this one. She's called uh, You Brought Me Love. Very cute. On Top of the World. This one I know by heart. <laughs> this one is something lights. Fairy lights. This one is really cute too. I have her too. I think the Black Star. And this one. The Puddles of Love. This one I got from uh, Barb's um, Etsy shop. Barb's, what is she called again? I don't want to butcher it. Barb's Craft Supplies on Etsy. Okay. Uh, here's this one. Poppy Wood. This one here. This one's called The Getaway. This one is The Collector. Love her too. This one's so cute. Um, pulling on your heartstrings. Love her too. She's one of the 
fairly new one, I think. New to me, anyway. Little Song. This one is so adorable, too. This one's called Heartfelt. Uh, another cute one. Look at the flower on her hair. Oops a daisy. This one is the the scarf. Really super cute. They have a huge one, a big one size of this one. <laughs> the little friend. Oh, love the hatter. Love her. And this one is Hush Little Bunny. That one's a little creepy, but it's still cute. Uh, this one is Violet, Little Violet. This one is From the Heart. And this one is the Night Light. So yeah, I only have, I don't know, about 30 of them. Something like that. Um, so yes, I plan to <laughs> get the rest of it. I can't help it. Now that I have the binder, now I have to get all of them. So hopefully I can find all of them. So um, yeah, thanks so much for watching, guys. And I hope you guys have a great, great week. Bye.